Well, it's one of the great battles in CONCACAF, playing Costa Rica. I think they developed a very strong team over the last couple of years and uh, have done very well. And uh, uh, beating them is very difficult. And we know that, you know, so they're on top of it with Mexico, with, with Honduras, you know, Panama right now is doing really well. So for us, it's a, it's a really good, good benchmark that we want to do well. We want to show them, you know, who's number one in CONCACAF after this tournament. And, and therefore, we, we're going to take them very, very seriously and want to beat them. They have qualities, especially in their individual players. They can make a difference, you know, within a second if you're not attentive enough. Um, obviously, Saborio, their, their key player up front, we know him all well, playing tremendously well in MLS too. Um, they, have, they have some good guys, even if maybe a Brian Ruiz is missing right now or Bolaños is missing. But the guys that are here, they're all first category. I expect it to be a, a, a battle from the beginning. Um, you know, they're still not too happy about the game and qualifying with the snow. And, uh, you know, obviously they want to get back at us. And um, this is a great opportunity for them to do that. Um, it's a tournament where they can get first place in the group. You know, they can go and, and play a third place team in another group. So, you know, there's all to play for. It's not uh, just um, hoping to go to a quarterfinal, which they already have, and us as well. But it's a game where um, they want to um, implement their um, superiority against us, and we want to do the same against them. It's going to be a difficult match. Both of us want to finish first uh, in the group. I think that uh, it'll be a lively match, one where both teams will be attacking. Uh, through the first three games, really, uh, that we've played here. Uh, we, we faced a team that sat back a lot more. I think that certainly they will do that at times, but you know, they have good attacking players that can hurt us, so we're going to have to keep, a, keep an eye on them. This, this is the start of the tournament. You know, tomorrow is the start of the tournament, and we, we need to be, you know, fit and ready. I think, you know, the boys have, you know, the last couple of days got rest, and, uh, you know, we're ready to play against Costa Rica. Well, the humidity is always difficult, just like the heat. Um, something that we, we've been dealing with through this tournament so far. I think this will be one of the, certainly one of the more humid ones, but uh, if we want to go far in this group and win the tournament, we're going to play in much hotter climates, so you know, we have to deal with it well. well. We are purely focused on this game. Uh, we don't want to interrupt the rhythm that we picked up now. And, uh, um, you know, there's enough time between this game now and the quarterfinal to get everybody regenerated and, 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 and back, you know, in, in perfect fitness. So this, uh, this game is, is like the final for Group C. You know, this is the, the team that we're going to fight for for World Cup qualifying points in September. So we want to we wanna send them a signal. So we take this very seriously and everybody is ready for this, this battle. We kind of saved a couple of legs in the game against Cuba, you know, with, with some changes that we made there. We won't save anybody for the game against Costa Rica.